Welcome back to Sliced Red Beer. What a battle inside the cooking room tonight <sighs> between Earls and Sopir. It's crazy. The cooking is finished. We are about to head to the judges' table to get their thoughts. Uh, P.S. Dora's the mean judge. Just putting it out there. <laughs> okay, so tonight for you, I went and made a just a plain breaded chicken breast. Added the ricotta cheese on just for the flavor. Got the... Uh, Kale and arugula salad with a lemon and olive oil dressing with the cider. And then with the potatoes went with the spring summer kind of feel with roasted with that sriracha sauce. Judges, Jeff, your first impressions of Chef Robert's dish. I really like the bright uh, brightness in the salad. I could taste the cider vinegar. Mm -hmm. um, I really liked, uh, there's some creaminess with the ricotta. The only thing I'm missing there is the sriracha. I'm not really getting that. There's a little bit of heat kind of catching up at the end there, but I was expecting a little more boldness from the potatoes there. Thank you. Nan, your first impressions. Once again, I am disagreeing with Jeff completely. He's wrong. <laughs> he is wrong. What I'm about to say is right. Um, and the potatoes have the perfect amount of sriracha. So um, my question for you is, what made you think to put sautéed mushrooms? I've never seen that before in your potato salad. In like the potato? It. Yeah, I, I like it. It just kind of like goes along with sitting at a on the back patio with my barbecue, adding in the peppers and the mushrooms and with the potato, because with my kids, they just eat just about anything. Yeah, good. Simona, what did you think when you took that first bite? Well, you know how you say, you know, you had me at hello. You definitely had me. Uh, you had my attention for sure when you said breaded chicken breast. So I love everything about it. I love the presentation. And I was curious about the ricotta cheese and I love the way it came, it came together. So, great job. Thank you. Let's move on to Dora. The mystery ingredients, can you taste all three in the dish? I certainly can, it's, you can, it's, I, I do disagree, sorry Jeff, but I can, I get the sriracha, absolutely. And the potatoes, there's enough in there for me. Uh, I can certainly taste the brightness of the vinegar. And uh, yeah, I can see the ricotta, I got the ricotta all going down there too. So, pretty good dish, thank you very Thanks. much. Pete, your entree has been served. Tell the judges what you have presented them. So I went like east meets west, a little bit of Asian with a little bit of French. With the three ingredients, with the sriracha, I put in a, a gastrique, finish up with that, uh, that cider vinegar. We got some uh, tomatoes in there that we kind of confit. We made uh, some fresh uh, ravioli. You know, I had in mind to do a cream sauce. You gave me some uh, ricotta, thick cream, beautiful, right in that. Sauce. I wish I had some wine to get the mushrooms drunk, but it didn't, so hopefully you enjoy. Okay, Jeff, you've had a chance to try Pete's entree. Any questions? I don't have any questions. I, I was most excited about the roulade, but I think the star is the ravioli and that ricotta cream sauce with the mushrooms. That's, Thank you. That's where I'm finding most of the flavor. That's what I'm enjoying the most on this plate. I find Thank you. I really it's got something. So I do like the, the sriracha um, and Cider gastric too. It's got a nice little bit of kick to it, but some sweetness there as well. So nice, nice balance there. So Excellent. really well done. Thank you. Thanks, Jeff. Chef Nan, you've had a couple bites. What do you think? Yeah, I think it's outstanding. And I believe it or not, I agree with Jeff. What? I agree <laughs> with him. I totally agree. I love the ravioli. I love the pancetta. It did a great job. The mushrooms are fantastic. Thank you. Awesome. Well done. Simona, can you taste the mystery ingredients? I can certainly taste the mystery ingredients for sure. And you know, you got my attention when you said French influence, so Thank that, you. I can certainly see that. And then I saw pancetta, can't go wrong with pancetta. <laughs> oh, I know the secret. <laughs> you know the secret, you, you knew what I like. Yeah. I saw you staring at the bacon, so. Yeah, so we got it, so yeah, awesome job. Thank you. Okay, Dora, it's up to you, what do you think? Well, I think you've won this hard hard ball over, so good job. <laughs> my, my only critique is I want more of that sauce all over my plate. I'm oh, sorry, I didn't know how spicy you like it. You know what, very good job. Yeah, thank Excellent. you. Awesome, thanks, good job, Pete. Thank you. It has been an amazing battle inside the cooking room. Sliced Red Deer, episode number two, round number two, between Earls and Sopir. But did the chefs do enough to impress the judges? Oh my goodness, you know what? When we come back, we find out who wins round two and who heads to the finale on March 24th. Woo!